What's up, everybody? I am Mr. McSpicy from the X1 Bros Positive Gaming Podcast and Community. I want to help again. Uh, I want to do a tips and tricks, uh, I guess, video of uh, Fortnite Battle Royale. Right now, I got the uh, top 16 at this point um, tips that I could think of that should help your gameplay a little bit. Enjoy. Number one. Populated areas equals lots of dead players. Try to avoid uh, the populated areas and you'll have a better chance at surviving the first 30 second scramble. Number two, enjoy the view. By that, I mean, don't jump out of the bus immediately. A ton of people like to jump out right away. The less people around you during the first 30 second scramble, the better chances you'll have to survive the most dangerous part of the entire match, the first 30 seconds. Three, avoid the 30 second scramble as much as you can. The further you glide, the less likely you will be with others. Not being sandwiched between tons of players at the beginning of the match will give you the time and hopefully the luck needed to find a gun. Four, Guns, 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 and ammo. Your goal in the immediate 30 seconds of the match is to find them ASAP. Five, avoid people, of course, unless you don't want to. And what I mean by that is uh, as you're floating down, look around you in the air to see who to avoid or if the conditions are right, who to attack. Keep an eye on everyone around you. Six, Try to, quote unquote, pilot wings the landing. And what I mean by that is to try to land right at the entrance or on the roof of a building. Seven, memorization. Try to memorize the locations you visit for loot spots and, of course, chests. Eight, gear up for each situation. I like to think that I have four permanent slots in my inventory and one bonus slot. I like to have a shotgun for close range, an AR for medium to long range, a sniper for long, and a healing slot. The fifth slot in my brain, I say, is my bonus slot for the boom booms or for special healing. Nine, take all ammo. Regardless of whether you need the weapon or not, grab the ammo. Ammo in your hand is ammo others don't have or don't have access to. Also, quick tip, you can quickly pick up only ammo by switching to your pickaxe and then just spamming that pickup button. 10. Weapon colors matter. This may seem obvious. Drop weaker we versions of weapons for the prettier ones. Nine times out of 10, the more rare the color of the weapon, the better the weapon. 11. Always look behind you. Enemies are either coming from behind you, that's what she said, or camping ahead of you. Move from cover to cover to make it harder for campers to hit you as you're uh, working your way to the middle of the map. 12. Elevate yourself. It's much easier to hit people with the elevated position, especially in third person as you can stay safe while peeking over those hills. 13. Don't run on top of a mountain. I know I just said get the elevated position, but don't run right on the tippity top of it. Instead, run just off to the side if you can. It's much easier to spot someone skylining a mountain than someone who is running just behind it or in front of it. 14. Learn to build cover quickly. If you are completely exposed and running from point A to point B, and all of a sudden you start to be, sh be shot in the back, uh, use those materials like crazy. Build, build, build. It's far better to overbuild and be alive than to underbuild and be dead. 15. Widen that final build in the center of the circle. A one-by-one -one tower is easily brought down with a good old-fashioned boom-boom rocket launcher at the ground floor. Build wider. 16. The last and final tip I have is simply you don't need to kill everyone to win. Every time you fight someone, you increase the chances of someone killing you. Yes, you'll get better. Yes, you'll understand situations more. But sometimes, especially in that first 30 second scramble, you can avoid people and stay alive.
Thanks, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this, uh, and I hope it helps. Love you guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching, and we hope you liked this video. If you did, hit that like button below and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to check out more of our awesome videos. We are your number one source for all things positive gaming. Check out our website at x1bros.com. You can see the link in the show notes below. And remember, if you're not having fun gaming, you're not doing it right. We'll see you guys next time.